It is a world of extraordinary delight and mystery. Today, scientists are able to visit parts of the planet that no human can access. With the aid of remotely operated vehicles, we have, for the first time, images from the deep sea. These creatures are so new to science that many do not have names. Some of these animals also have rather large eyes, but as you can see, very big mouths and sharp teeth, so when they capture prey, they're not likely to, to lose them, um, because in the deep sea, prey is hard to find. What's also exciting is that you're, you're characterizing uh, part of the planet that just is largely undiscovered in general. New currents, new processes, new interactions between organisms in the environment that have never been described before. So it's a really fertile and fresh area uh, for discovery, for science, and more so now perhaps even than a hundred years ago because we have new tools of, of, with technology, um, genetics, to look at the oceans in new and exciting ways. It's a whole new world down there and I think just the fact that you have to use equipment to breathe um, makes you feel like you're the foreigner in this environment and all these animals live here and they know how to live here and you don't. 